In this video, we're going to go over the signs for titles, not just in the East Kingdom, but in the whole of the SCA as well, because these are titles that are universal. They are pretty much the same no matter what kingdom you are in. The first title that a person can have is that of a champion. The sign for champion starts by making a three finger shape. Curl your fingers down so that it's more of a claw shape and then take that and stick it on top of your index finger and the tip of your finger should land just about in the center of your palm. This is the sign for champion as in the position or uh, title of champion. If you want to show a person who is or who, who has become a champion, just stick your person sign on the end of that. So we've got the position of champion and a person who is a champion. Next title is Baron or Baroness, and this is the same sign whether it is for a landed seated baroncy or a court baroncy. It's the same either way. Now for uh, one person of that title, you make a six, uh, which is touching your thumb to your pinky, and we do this because a baronial coronet has six pearls on it. Bring that up to the top of your head and then pull across to your temple. You're drawing the shape of the coronet across your head. So that's for one person who is a baron or baroness. If there is a second person who is in the court that you are signing for of the same title, you do it with two hands. Now, one-handed versus two-handed is not meant to delineate male versus female. You could have two barons, you could have two baronesses, you could have one of each. The one-hand versus two-hand simply means you are showing two different people of the same title. And that is the same concept that we use for all of the other um, title signs in the SCA. There are two different shapes that you make. One goes from your opposite shoulder down to your hip, that's the sash shape. And the other one goes from opposite shoulder to dominant shoulder down to hip. That is the triangle or V shape. And um, these shapes are meant to show that there are two people of the same rank. And it, um, it doesn't, again, does not matter whether it's uh, male or female. For example, if we make the sign with a D finger shape, you have um, down this way or you have across this way, that's the sign for Duke and Duchess. And you could, you could have two Dukes, two Duchesses, one of each, doesn't matter. Um, we do the sash and the V to show there are two people in court who are the exact same rank. Now, if you make that those shapes with a C, you have Count and Countess. If it's a V, you have Viscount, Viscountess, Viceroy, Vicerine. Um, that is uh, pretty much the basic rule with all of the all of your other titles in the SCA. Um, if you do it with an R, it's uh, Regents or Royals. And again, two different shapes to show two different people who are of the same rank. So those are those are the basic um, sign formulas for your titles in the SCA.